Well, hello guys, welcome back. Um, we're going to try a double shot of Okin Gaming. We usually don't, at least I try not to, but I thought you might enjoy this. This is Larana. This is by the same people that brought us that spooky game we just played. So we're going to hit play here. This is also free, by the way. So this is a free game and it's going to be pretty friendly because look at the cute little Lorana we're going to play and, and it was funny I was trying to pronounce this I was trying up recording before this and somebody in the back um, helped me with the Spanish and it was actually accurate and I was so surprised that I actually quit <laughs> um, I quit I double checked it you guys know I don't speak a lick of it but I wanted to sound halfway intelligent um, isn't this pretty look at that is that not pretty so we're not going to buzz through this, but you can see this will have pretty simple puzzles. Once upon a time in a world where magic sleeps, two gods ruled the jungle. Rana the frog had dominion over rain. He and his attendants were beloved by all. And you can see the pretty world. Isn't that beautiful? And just hippy hoppy through the levels. And you don't have to go in any precise order, whatever makes you happy. Great Temple was built to hold the source of Rana's power, the River Heart. Um, this takes about a half hour to complete. So if you grab a drink, feel free. And it reminds me of Zing, which is why I love it. It's got all these cute little details and soft music. It's not VR, though it keeps trying to be VR. So just be aware that if you have a VR headset, it's going to try to turn it on. That's not going to hurt anything, just be aware that that's there. It's a real relaxing platformer. If you fall, you just reappear. It's nothing, you know, scary or anything. And take your time and look around. Rana's sister, Serpente, was born a snake. Her power came from her mighty coils. Now, I hope I just got that right. I got you back here. So, frog and snake. Are their names are the brother and sister so let's do it this way this time she parted the earth winding through the stone jungle to carve rivers and lakes okay i think i might have done that off order let me see But man's affection was for Rana. They spared no thought for a serpentine. She's gonna get her name pronounced 50 different ways. Hey, I got Rana good. That, that's all I care about right now. Poor Snakey. And people pointed out you could, you could speed run this probably in like five minutes. Once you know what you have to do, but you don't have to. Just take your happy little frog on his happy little frog journey. Over many lonely years, forgotten, Snake's heart grew cold and chillless. It's almost never good. Let's see. I think I have to go do a little bit more. Yep. So. She had a plan to seal the river heart, then mankind would love her again. I feel kind of bad for her. Snicky snakes are pretty. And many of the people forgot how pretty she was. 
While Rena and his attendant Spear slept, she struck. So I'm gonna go get a drink. Just, it's pretty. I like how the flame effects work. I like how pretty and wholesome it is. We can play wholesome games. They won't harm us. I actually like games like this. I wish there were more out there. And I don't care if this is for little kids. This is kind of fun. Okay, let me make sure I got everything down here. Oh yeah, there's this half of the temple too. They tried to stop her, but she came prepared with poison to steal from loneliness. And that's indeed what will happen. If you let yourself get lonely and bitter, it will poison everything you do. I got wow back here. That was insightful. I know, right? Every so often I surprise even me. <laughs> I got giggling. He's kidding. He likes to tease. He's lucky. So how are you guys doing? You enjoying yourselves? I was actually delighted to find this. I, I like these more innocent games. I, I'm not gonna lie and say I just play cutesy stuff. You guys have seen what I play, but... Sometimes something a little more innocent is nice too. Okay. Sometimes just because of the way it's made, you're gonna have to take those shots a little... Now, if I remember, that's all I need, but we'll see. Happy little frog. He's just happy. Get him a little drink. And look at that, look at that light. And this is free, guys. This is fun. I think this is free all the time, but I'm not sure, so I'm gonna give you the link. Because I wouldn't want you guys to miss out on froggy goodness. It's just is pretty. The spirits' bodies were frozen to stone and their stone their souls went dormant, so you know you're rescuing the frogs. Oh, this makes a lot more sense when you do it the right way the first time. <laughs> Yeah, some of those jumps will take your breath away, because you don't think you're going to make them. Serpentine slithered through the temple. I know I just got that wrong, leaving poison and destruction in her wake. Okay, so this one's going to take a tiny bit of brain power. If I remember how to do this. believe this is right. Whee! Okay, I didn't have to go in the air this time, but that's a good skill to have, as you'll see. So welcome to the second part of the temple. Isn't this pretty? It's not super complicated. It doesn't have to be. You're just a little frog trying to make it in a big world. I'm sure there's a profound message there somewhere. And you don't even have to hit all those waterfalls and just having froggy fun. And take the time to look at some of this stuff. It is pretty level design, I'll, I'll give them credit. And for those of you that don't game, wondering why I'm fussing so much, Everybody that does like playing games has paid more than they would like to admit for some ugly games. Isn't that neat? The river heart glittered helpless as a star as she wound tight around it. Aren't I cute? Okay, let me see if I remember this. I think I get it off here. 
If you mess this up, if you go the wrong way, it's pretty forgiving. The most you're gonna do, the most horrific thing you'll do is fall off the platform. But when she made to slink off, she found she could not move. And sometimes you'll find out stuff like this. Like, I could not make that move from that area. So I'm gonna have to figure this puzzle out. Um, trying to make us jumps is a little hard stopping when you're not sure if you can make it or not. But like, it's, it's colorful, it's kind of serene, it's non-violent. Cute little frog. Some light like, puzzle solving skills. All of Serpentine's um, bitterness had seeped into her heart, turning her to stone. You can hear the cute little frogs. As time passed, the temple and its denizens faded into forgotten sleep. So yeah, this reminds me a lot of Zing. I honestly would not be surprised to find out that that was at least part of the inspiration. Okay, so I've got five billion puzzles here to solve. Let me see if I remember any of this. Nope. Okay, so that one's not yet. Okay, can I make us jump? And if you ever fail a jump, you'll just reappear on the platform, so it's no... No big deal, it's nothing traumatic. I honestly don't remember some of these. <laughs> After many years, Rana um, managed one last act of power. He filled his lungs with clean water and breathed a single spirit back to life. Whoop. Yeah, you can't you can miss. So I'm kinda glad that happened. You can miss. But it's no big deal. Little one awoke, frightened and alone, but imbued with the power of a god. Oh, I forgot that one took us the whole way across. Without being told, he knew what he must do. Other than being cute and adorable, that is. So this one's going to be a bit of a puzzle, because you've got to go... Let me see if I remember this one. Okay, I think it works this way. Let's just be counterintuitive and wrong. There we go. Hopefully I just did the right thing. You guys doing okay? I believe I was correct on that, we'll find out. Because nothing really changes until you get onto these, and then, aha. Yay! So 
That's not as hard as I remember. That's a nice thing when you redo these things. You have experience on your side. To restore life to the temple, he must free the river heart. If he could do this, the temple would reawaken and rain would fall once more. So let's get a big drink because he's pretty thirsty. That's cute. Say it that way, but I got on back here. He's just, he's cute. And here we are, guys. So it's not the longest game in the universe, but you know what? That's okay. I don't need a drink, but let's, let's get one more drink, just in case. Okay, now did I do something wrong? Because this is what happened last time. I got down here and I was like, now what? Aha! Uh -huh. So it, it's a little bit of a challenging puzzle this time. Also, you can hit those blue targets. Is this is kind of fun. And it's, it's just adventure enough. jumps were scarier than the last game we played. I was thinking of it as I was talking to one of you about the game and I'm like, honestly, this might have some more scary moments in it. There's no enemies, nothing's gonna come flying at you out of anywhere. But it's fun. And it's cute. And something you can play with the kids, so there's that. And it's free, so yay! So this one is going to be our final puzzle. So we hope you guys have enjoyed this. This was something really cute to find. drink. I went the other way last time, so we're being fancy. But I, I figured you guys would like this. I think I've been pronouncing the poor snake's name wrong, but hey. Here we go. We have saved the jungle, and the rains will fall once more. So I thought it was kind of a cute analogy for what we're going through. You know, you can go through difficult times, but Lorena made it through, so you can make it through. Tiny little frog makes it through, you will make it through. So this again is by the college that made that spooky 
kind of art house thing that we just went through. And they have, you know, a bunch of free games over there. You guys should really check them out. Um, even if you're not much of a gamer, get yourself... Yeah, see, it's Southern Methodist University. I told you guys it was a religious college. Um, anyhow, get yourself a um, little library of these free games. And even if you're not much of a gamer, you have them for free. So, you know. So if you guys like what you see, like, comment, subscribe. I just, I thought this was adorable and it was wholesome. And it, it amuses me to know and that it, it was made by the Methodist Church. I think I've been in a Methodist Church exactly once in my life, but there you go. So if you like what you see, like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you later. Bye-bye.